good day everyone especially to you dr craig so for the task number two i'll be sharing the, the research entitled the calculator project formal reasoning about programs studied by steve reeves department of computer science university of waikato new zealand Doug Goldson, Department of Computer Science, Massey University, New Zealand. Pat Fong, Tim Oshia, Site the Open University, Melbourne Keynes, UK. Mike Hopkins, Richard Bornart, Bornart, Department of Computer Science, QMW, London, UK. So for the tabulations and discussions snippet, I pick up the figure number five. So in considerations to different groupings of students using levels of programming, expertise, and math backgrounds in order to address this point, perhaps surprisingly, there appeared to be no significant relationship between the benefits of using Mira calculator and levels of programming expertise in relations to FP1 scores. So in here's figure five, We've been comparing the advancement students with a parity value of zero less than um, less than zero point zero three. So for the student group, we have math not used Mira calculator and math used Mira calculator. So for the math not used Mira calculator in line in mean score, there is fifty one point eleven. For the mean rank 10.0 and cases of 9. For the row of math used mirror calculator, for the mean score there is 78.750. For the mean rank 17.2 and cases of 29 at, at 20. So a total of 29 cases. So looking at the relationship between the use of mirror calculator, mark math background and fp1 however was very enlightening here in relations to fp fp1 we look at two groups so those students with a mathematical background example had studied math at a levels and those without a math background so within each of these groups we then looked at whether they had used mirror calculator so for the next table a figure this figure six in here comparing non-advanced math students so for the student group both no uh, no math not use mirror calculator and no math used mirror calculator okay so for the no math and not used mirror calculator in mean score there is 21.143 for min rank, there is 17.07 .07, cases of 14. And for the no math use mirror calculator, so for the mean score 57.36, for min rank 36.82, and for cases of 50, a total of 64 with a parity value of less than 0 0.001. So the result shows an interesting contrast there is a significant difference between those who had used the software tool and those who hadn't in relations to FP1 and of year scores in the group of students who had studied A-level math. This difference is, however, is far more pronounced within the group of students who had not studied A-level math. Indications are then that the use of the software tool mirror calculator has had a positive effect upon the learning outcomes and that this effect is most strongly seen in the results of those students who had not studied A-level math. Given that one of the principal motivations for developing and introducing these software tools had been to address difficulties, which non-mathematical students experience. So this is a most encouraging result. So a final observation based purely on anecdotal evidence from teaching staff was that students threat a theoretical course like introductions to logic more seriously when it is supported with love, labs just as the programming courses were. 
So that is all for the different tabulations and the discussions of the research, the calculator project, formal reasoning about programs. Thank you. I'm Monalina G. Alvarasin.